Hello, wonderful people of Coded M2O. I'm here another time to make a video on the process that I go through in order for me to make an order. So this video is going to show you step by step process from the time that you play, you you add the orders to your um, cart or you do your direct placement to the time that you place the order to the time that you make you sorry to the time that you submit the order to the time that you what um, you make payment so that is what this video is about and I hope it helps you I'm going to use the website format to do one and also show you how you'll be able to use the app also to do one it's the same process but I'm going to do all of them together just to help those of us who are preferences in the among the two who wish to do the website more than the app and those who wants to do the app more than the website so if you are ready for that just keep glued to your phone and watch the video to the end because it's going to help you and to prevent you from making the mistakes that you've been making all this while so with that said let's get into the video now the first thing that i do is that i go to the 1688 app go to the store search for the thing that i want to do copy the link or if i want to style it i style it in a link which is in the video that i made on how to um, copy the link i added it as a bonus so you can watch that one too then if um, I go to the app or the store, I copy the link and I paste it somewhere. So this time around, you can see that this particular person added, asked me to place this order for her. So I tap on the link, use the Chrome to log in. Then I tap, I tap on the orange bar over here. So I'm seeing that it gets the the app has opened directly nowadays that is what is happening so far as you have the app and you're trying to use the chrome it will open directly by itself so don't worry when it happens like that when it happens like that just tap on this place then go back to the chrome then cancel this one then let's select the quantities that we want we want this one three we want this one four this one we want three uh, let's choose yeah so it's up to the number that we are we want to buy so now you come and tap on the orange bar below so tap on it okay so it looks like this it looks like this and you can see your shipping address if it is your first time there won't be anything over here so you just have to tap on, on this particular place for you to add your um, shipping address to it you can just copy your shipping address and then you put it somewhere if you don't know how to do that watch my video on how to place an order on 168 and that will guide you to be able to put your shipping address in in there so after coming here now one thing that i said that in order for if you are doing pre-ordering in order for you to get the final price to your customers what you have to do is to come to this place make sure you do all this thing to get a final price you see over here 45.5 the final price you see over here before you can be able to uh, to place the order make sure you do that so now we are here and now i can change the address now the person sent me a different address this is my personal address that i use so i just have to change the person's address i've added it already so i'm going to select it among the many address that i have you can see that i have a lot of address now right more on so i'm going to select it i'm going to select this one all right so it's been selected so now i can place the order for the person okay so after it's loading what i'll do is i'll tap on submit the system so um let me reload now that i reloaded it i need to choose the address again my address personal address has been made permanent so when i reload it i have to i have to go back and do it so now 
we tap on submit submit our order so we wait as it loads okay so let me rotate it so i'll be able to get it the place to tap on the submit so submitting my order submitting my order all right so this interface pop up after tapping on submitting order and you can see that alipay has been selected already because that is the payment method that i'm going to use this place you choose the payment method that you are using and it's always preferable if you use the alipay because that is what you, the number that you use in connecting to 1688 indirectly yeah so you can see that it says please complete the payment within four days for um, 23 hours and 59 minutes if if we if i'm not able or if i don't want to pay today i can just leave this then make the payment later but it shouldn't exceed four days because the moment it's exceed four days they will make it uh, the submission expired you see they will expire the submission then i will have to go through the same process again now where to see this is on pay under pending payment if you watch my video on how to track your items you see the process that i made that when you go to your back office you see pending payment so this where this place will be, this things is going to be if i want to make continue to make the payment i go to that place and watch and continue and make the payment now you want to make the payment directly so we tap on to pay now when you tap on to pay the next thing is for you to put in your your um uh, your payment password which if you have not set it on alipay you should go back there and set it now when it loads i'm going to pause the video and continue with it so after putting your payment password over here this is what it tells you that payment is successful finished so we are done paying um, our supplier using the website the next phase i'm going to use the um, app to guide you also on how to do that on the app is it not nice now if it's the first time watching this video or coming to our channel please i plea and implore that you subscribe you hit the notification button and you like if you are if you are loving this video and if you are loving the the kind of content that this channel is giving you subscribe hit the notification button and like and you can share to as many friends that you want to also benefit from this particular channel with that said let's go back to we using the app okay so you tap on finish and this place will come telling you to return home or you can check your order so you can tap on check order and you can see where your order is i just wanted to show you i didn't want this video to be longer but i have to just show you so you can see your order is at what um to be delivered yeah to be delivered that is where your order is you can view the logistics detail where you'll be able to get your tracking number and your order number at that place now this place is your order number when you scroll down you can see your order number here you can see your order number here yeah so you can chat the supplier too from this place uh, yeah now let's go to making the video on how to do it the app now we are in the app and we want to place an order of this particular good on the app so the first thing is if you have copied the link somewhere you can just tap on it then you log in through the app then if you you start it um, in your favorite you can go to your favorite then you pick it up into this interface will then come then we start the process of what, placing an order so what we do is you can tap on the orange button as you did on the website then this thing comes then you look for the inches and uh, the kind that we want that the specification we want to buy now as you see on the app they've shown me my um, warehouse address at this place so if I want to change it this is why I will change it 
this way I'll change it. It doesn't go the same way on the website. It's a bit different. So let's let's do that. Let's select the the inches that we want. We want the 60 pieces of the six inches. So let's do that. So 60 pieces. Yeah. Download more on free. So we want the 60 pieces of the six inches. When we are done. We are done selecting we tap on where our address is and change it to the one that the person who asks us to buy for once so we've done that we've done that now the next thing is to scroll down let me, let me wait for it to load okay so after loading you see that it has chosen alipay for me this is the website so the website you are able to do everything at the time that you are placing order you are able to do everything you need not to submit the order first before you will be able to see your total prices so from here the price you see are down here they add everything why are they sending me back again these people hold on all right so i don't know why they sent me back but then we can still go through the process again pick our warehouse address we want 60 pieces of the of this so select it after selecting go down and see as your alipay has been selected total price hasn't come yet all right so Let's just tap on the orange bar to submit the order. Alright, so you see the total price below has come and I'm saying that this place you need not to go to the submission point to get a final price. Right from here you'll be able you can be able to see the 174 as your total price, which if you are doing pre-order, you can then use it and do your calculations on it and give it to your customers so when we tap on the orange bar below we tap on the orange bar below we we should get our um, order submitted then we continue to make our payment now here you see that it has, it has given me a lot of payment options now I can you can see this card which is heading with a 77 7077 and the other one 5885 now that one is my top pass yeah the top pass that i created previously so if i was having money on it i could have used it but now the top pass is not working anymore and they are using a different other medium which i'm going to make a video on it so uh, for you to know how to use that one too now i have money in my alipay balance this is my alipay balance so i'm going to use that to make the payment so i tap on the blue bar over there for it to send me to the place that i um put in my payment password so let me pause it so i've inserted in my payment password and voila it is done everything is done right there i want it to load so that you see the same thing the same indication so you come to let's with this thing you come to here and it says check order and here it says well, focus on the store that is a go home all right so we want to check the order on the app too to see where it is and what what we should be expecting so that is it the same format the same format so there's just a little um differences between it so um that is it that is it here too when you go down you'll be able to see your order number the order number is here which you can copy you can tap this place to Download copy more on all right so um after doing that you can see our item on you can see our item 
had to be delivered yeah to be delivered yeah so that is it so um friends over here if you really love the content that we, we, we do please push up help us you know to reach a lot of people you know like the videos if it is your first time please subscribe a lot of you have been watching the video but you don't subscribe if you don't subscribe you get the benefits that we are giving you but then you are not subscribing which is really not helping which is really not helping with that said um as i've been saying in my previous video i'm trying to make a mass um mini importation class for a lot of people and if you are interested stick glued to your our channel and when the time is right you'll be able to join so we learn together with that said see you later and please make sure you trade with care